Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 12th, December 12th. This is for all signs. We're just going to see whatever comes up for today. Keep in mind that this is for all signs, but it's not a private reading, so... It may not be for you, but tomorrow's could be, So, or the ones that I did yesterday, so feel free to go back. Um, I focus on love. Uh-oh, the Empress reversed. Somebody is not experiencing growth. There's like a loss of abundance here. Lack of self-worth. We could have a woman that's chasing a man. Not getting what she wants. She doesn't know her worth. That sucks. Lack of wish fulfillment. Yes, yeah, she's not getting what she wants. We have a woman that's not getting what she wants because she doesn't know her worth. Oh my goodness. Not receiving a blessing. You know, you... If you don't know what you're worth, you're not going to receive a blessing. I mean, you have to love yourself. You have to nurture yourself. You have to take care of yourself to receive blessings. I mean, really. Mmm. Oh my goodness. There's a lack of balance. There's a lack of harmony. There's a lack of patience. There's um, you know, refusing to evolve. Refusing to let things be as they are. We have a we have a woman. The Empress is a woman, okay? She's not a man. We have a woman here that is not allowing herself to evolve. Oh my God. She has multiple options, but she's not choosing wisely. She may be choosing like a married man or somebody that's attached or something like that. Therefore, she's never, ever, ever going to get that ultimate wish fulfillment. Because you don't receive blessings for doing that kind of stuff. You don't. Trying to be sneaky or trying to uh, escape. Doing things the right way. Whatever the case is. It's like there's an absence of, of transition. There's an absence of transformation here. Because we have a woman that is... Uh, <sighs> Lacking self-worth. Okay. That's what's going on here. <laughs> this woman needs to evolve. She needs to transition. To receive blessings. She does. To receive a miracle. The wish fulfillment that she wants. She has to evolve. She has to allow it instead of fight it. You don't receive a reward for not being a good person. I'm sorry, but that's what this is. Now, there could be some something happening very quickly that is moving someone in a new direction. This woman is selfish. The Empress reversed is a selfish woman who doesn't care who she hurts. She's only looking out for herself. And you, you don't get blessings if you don't nurture, you know, 
You need to you need to nurture yourself. You need to care. You need to care about you, how your actions affect other people. Anyway, just saying. I know a lot of you women are like, <gasps> well, that's the truth. Okay, you don't. I have to I have to tell you, you do not get a reward for involving yourself in a third party situation, ever. You might get a short term reward. You might get short term gratification. But that's a lesson that needs to be learned, usually the hard way. Anyway, the Empress has life experience, and this woman hasn't gained the experience she needs yet. She's in reverse. She doesn't know. She's, she's not being wise at all. We have a woman here that's not being wise. The very first card by involving herself in a third-party situation doesn't care who she hurts. Therefore, you know, she's going to run into some problems okay she's gonna run into some problems because she doesn't care who she hurts I'm just saying I'm just saying anyway we have something somebody that's going in a new direction or somebody that's taking action now this this I'm not sure if this is a man or who it is but this is somebody moving in a new direction towards victory and success Now this could even, you could say that this is the man moving away from this woman because this woman don't get no respect. She doesn't get respect and she allows it. We have this woman that doesn't care if she's respected because she doesn't respect other people. So when you don't, you know, you get what you give, right? You do get what you give. So anyhow, that's the way the universe works. We will zoom this in in a minute. But somebody is moving in a new direction. They may make, it may be a sudden decision to move in a new direction that, you know, We have a com moving, yeah, in a new direction, absolutely. Something is being cleared out. Ending. Major completion here. Now, this is a lesson. The world card is a major lesson learned. This woman is going to learn, see where it's landing, is going to learn a major lesson the hard way. And that is no joke. So, yeah, we have a woman that is not being wise at all. At all. She's settling. She's hurting people. Um, not wanting to own up to it. She's not wanting to own up to it because, you know, she's thinking that she, she's not doing anything wrong. She is. If you involve yourself in a third party situation, whether you're the other person or not, you, you're doing something wrong. And I'm not judging anybody. I'm just telling you what this is. This woman is about to learn a lesson for her actions. Just saying. Because the Empress deals with pain to give birth. This woman, she's not giving a shit. She's not dealing with any pain. She doesn't care who she hurts. Period. You got to think about pain, how it affects other people. Now, this could be the other woman. Say you're the say you're the innocent woman. This could be the other woman. We have a woman here that doesn't care who she hurts, and she's gonna learn a lesson, and she's not gonna get reward for it. So rest assured. She's wasting her time and she needs to turn her back on this situation for her, you know, arrival. This is not prepared. Not appreciated. Delayed. Somebody is delaying their own wish fulfillment. That sucks. Have to put in effort to evolve. You have to put in effort to change. You have to put in effort to receive blessings. You do. You do. You have to work hard to get your reward. You do. And you have to be stable. You have to be practical. You have to stop sacrificing yourself for needless 
things, people that are never going to attach to you. This is the master of non-attachment. It's reverse. It's like somebody is sacrificing themselves for a person that isn't putting in any effort, really. It's like sacrificing. It's time to accept a change. It's time to look at things from a new perspective. And it looks as though somebody could quickly change their mind. You know, maybe, maybe, I don't know who it is, if it's the man or the woman, somebody may quickly change their mind and stop sacrificing themselves for this third party situation, whatever it is, and let it go. It's too heavy, it's too burdensome, it's, it's a lie, it's baggage, it's overwhelming, and it needs to be dropped. A completion, an ending of something that is too heavy to even hang on to. It looks to me like somebody is deciding to move in a new direction and drop something that they have been holding on to, needlessly. Maybe a sudden decision to do so. A sudden decision, decision to drop it or move on, I'm, I, you know. I've, I've uh, hindered and delayed my wish fulfillment for long enough. So we do have a completion, an ending here, and right, they're both mirroring each other. Somebody is dropping something and leaving it behind to bring victory and success to their lives. That's what's happening. Somebody is learning a big lesson for involving themselves in a third party situation. That's what's going on here. They thought that if they put a lot of effort into it and they really, you know, <laughs> went above and beyond, they might be able to, you know, convince whoever this person is to come in their direction, but that's not happening. This person isn't compromising. This person isn't cooperating. This person isn't changing their mind. They're not changing. The person that they're waiting for isn't doing anything. Isn't doing what they said they were going to do. That's a tough, tough lesson, isn't it? You don't ever get a reward for this. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I mean, you know what I am. I mean, I'm, I'm basically a seer. I'm a messenger, okay? And I'm here to tell you that you do not get wish fulfillment and reward for involving yourself in a third party situation. You will never get that ultimate reward. And that's a tough lesson. So yeah, somebody is putting themselves, themselves in the driver's seat and heading out, heading away from this situation. I'm out. I'm looking for love. I'm looking for true love. This has been, you know, that third party situation. Somebody is heading out of a third party situation quickly, quickly. It could be the man. It could be the man that says, you know what? I don't want to deal with you anymore. I never respected you anyway. <laughs> and he didn't. Okay. He didn't anyway. So, you know, there's a lack of respect for sure. There's, or there is somebody, this woman is not respected for her actions. So somebody is headed out of this situation, this third party situation in search for love, real love. Because they were, they were dealing with a trickster, a manipula manipulator, a liar. 
somebody, this is going right here, was trying to manifest somebody into their life that was already attached. Or unavailable. Definitely a third party situation here. I, I'm positive. And it's like they've taken extremes. I mean, this is a crafty individual who, you know, had hidden agendas. They saw that this woman didn't know her worth. So they were like, bang, I can get that one. And manipulate her and lie to her and deceive her because she doesn't know her worth. I'm in control. Somebody has been dealing with a tricky, crafty, sneaky, manipulative individual. But they allowed it. They allowed it. Thinking that they were gonna they were gonna get that wish fulfillment by playing their own tricks, you know, thinking they were gonna get away with it. Well, universe watches, sees everything, everything. I didn't want to be alone. This person didn't want to be alone. They didn't feel, I mean, they didn't feel abundant with themselves. Lack of self-worth again. We definitely have a woman here that doesn't know her worth and got involved with a trickster. She became a trickster and now there's no reward here. There's no wish fulfillment. Because we have two crafty individuals who got involved with each other and now... Somebody is turning their back and moving on. And somebody's learning a tough lesson about self-worth for sure. As above, so below. You get what you give. That's what I was trying to tell you. You never get a reward. As above, so below. It's the truth. Goodbye. I'm not doing this anymore. Somebody is making a, de a decision to walk away, and I think it's like an instant decision. All of a sudden, they receive some sort of epiphany. I'm not doing this anymore. I'm moving in a new direction. I'm traveling down a new road. I'm ready for change. I'm ready for this transformation. I'm ready to drop this baggage, to drop this load, and to end this cycle. Somebody is making a decision to, to walk away from a third-party situation. And head in a new direction. They've been deceived, and they've deceived. Both people have deceived. And there's really no long-term reward with deception. And somebody, it looks to me like somebody is realizing that. So I feel like today is a day of somebody completing... A partnership that was built on lies because they're not receiving the wish fulfillment that they thought that they were going to receive. They're walking away, heading in a new direction. That's what I see. Somebody is saying goodbye. Goodbye. Standing up for themselves. So yeah, I feel like today is a day of somebody really 
dropping something that is too heavy to hold on to. Let's get one of these. Let's get one of these. Somebody is finding the strength to move on. It's clear. It's very clear. I, I don't belong here. This isn't never going to. There's no. There's no hope. There's no trust. Even built on a lie. There's a relationship that's built on a lie that isn't leading to nothing. It isn't. It's not. Rainbow blessings. Blessings are showering your life. So maybe you will receive a blessing for walking away. One blessing that you're going to receive is peace because rainbows are a sign of peace. When you walk away from something that is a lie, you, you find peace. I'm going to go ahead and read this card. You will receive a blessing for walking away. You will. Somebody is walking away. Okay? Walking away, dropping the load, moving in a new direction, completion of a chapter. I wasted my time. It's clear. It's clear. Blessings in all forms are cascading into your life. Just as the rainbow has all the colors of the spectrum, so is every hue of your life blessed. This is a great time to start a project, purchase a house, begin a health program, or start a new journey. Let go of hesitations and concerns. Whatever you dream of for your future, this is the time to start. When the rainbow appears in the sky above or in the oracle deck, have faith that blessings are coming. Count your blessings. Be grateful for the ones you've received. And somebody hasn't been grateful. They have not. In the deepest sense, you are a blessing. In many ways, the rainbow is a messenger from their creator, letting you know that all is well. This card can also indicate that it's time to add some color to your life. Change the colors of your curtains or simply spice up your life. Change the colors of the room. It says paint a room. It's time for a change so that you will receive the blessings that you deserve. So somebody is going to receive a blessing. You see where I put the card? For walking away. A blessing for walking away from a third party situation. That's what this is. But you have to walk away. You do not receive a blessing for manipulation, for lies, for cheating, for trickery, for hurting another person. You don't receive blessing for that. You do not. Trust me. And if you don't believe me, keep doing it. You'll be hurt more in the end. There's a major completion here of something that was a, was a lie. Because there's no wish fulfillment there. There's a lack of self-worth. There's a lack of... You know, I don't need to go over it again. 
Somebody is walking away and, and headed towards a new blessing for doing so. But there's a delay. There's a delay. Okay? There's a delay of receiving. Delay of receiving a blessing because of this situation. So anyway, that's what I have for today. I wish you the best. Good luck.